also new tonight. Sometimes you can't beat the deals you find on sites like OfferUp or Craigslist, but shopping online always comes with a risk. 13 Action News reporter Annalisa Ortiz explains how a new law hopes to make online shopping more safe. Yeah, you think it'd be common sense by now, but sometimes you get so excited to buy that perfect Christmas gift online. And it's easy to forget the person you're buying it from could be dangerous. It was the right color, right mileage. I fell for it. Russell Whitmore nearly lost $1,000 when he tried to buy a car online. One of his big mistakes, not meeting up with the seller in person. I didn't have a name. I didn't have a, a face. Everything was by email. But meeting up with someone you met online can get you scammed or even robbed, like in this case from 2016 when a cell phone sale went wrong near Bonanza and MLK. So if something feels funny, you get a gut instinct, trust it. Just a few months ago, a new law went into effect here in Nevada. It requires counties and cities to designate at least one police station as a safe zone for people who are buying and selling things online. If someone doesn't want to meet you at the police department, that might be a red flag. The North Las Vegas Police Department was ahead of the new law. They've been inviting the public to do online sales at their Northwest and South Area commands for the past two years. If it's inconvenient, you'd rather be inconvenient than in danger. And the warning also goes for people who are selling things. You never know exactly what that interested buyer might really be after. Annalise Ortiz, 13 Action News.